What up, though, Heist Man Defoe? Things I seen on Twitter. Man. I'm kind of late with this, man. This thing is Tuesday. I used to do this on Sundays. But I'm doing it today. It's Tuesday. So, we'll see some things that made me smile on Twitter. Made me laugh or just... Things I just seen on Twitter that tickle my fancy. Here we go. Let's see what this first picture is. Look at this. I don't know who these dudes' names are, but they are smiling. And they look just like these shoes right here. Teeth and all. This made me laugh when I seen this on Twitter. This made me smile. This gave me something to look at. Let's see what else. This one right here. This was, when I seen this picture, it was captioned by, look at all the side eyes in this one photo. Everybody giving everybody the side eye. If you look at this, I'm talking about, man, this is crazy. Let's look at it. This chick right here at the bottom. Look at everybody just looking. Oh, let's expand it out a little bit, man, because this is crazy. Everybody looking at everybody crazy. And this one photo, why are everybody looking like that? It's over in Africa somewhere. I, I assume, I, you know. <laughs> look at everybody. Everybody looking crazy. <clears throat> I seen that. I thought that was funny, man. Everybody was looking at each other crazy. All right, we'll see what else. Ooh, this right here. This is a uh, an illusion, optical illusion, or something. You can see it spinning. Every once in a while, you can look at it and see it spinning. But people say that um, if it's spinning real fast, I mean, you have high levels of stress or something like that. I don't know. It's just spinning regular to me, like every few seconds. But mm, if it's spinning real fast, I mean, you're going through some stress. You need to sit down. What else? <laughs> so I love ripping the fishnets off these slutty oranges. <laughs> That's what it looked like, some fishnets. It's <clears throat> pretty cool. That made me laugh. What else? Blech! Coleslaw popsicles. I don't know who wants these. I don't know who's going to eat these, but I know it ain't going to be me. Look at that. I would not try that. I can't do it. That looks nasty. <clears throat> I'm drinking coffee this morning. It ain't morning, but I'm drinking coffee. Look at this. So I found them. I'm a cat connoisseur myself. I like cats more than dogs. Way, 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 way more than dogs. This cat is, um, look just like this cat. <laughs> look mean. <laughs> I never seen a mean looking cat like that. Like, I see some mean looking cats, but this one looks cute and mean. Cute and cuddly. Big shout out to that, to that cat. I like that. Oh, this right here. This is some dude locked up. Locked up. And he has a whole spread of Outback Steakhouse. I'm talking about, look at the bed, yo. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten plates. Probably ten plus. We can't see what else up there. But he got, look at this. <clears throat> he is behind bars. He got a whole, whole spread. What kind of, like, come on, man. He eat better than some people that's not in jail. And he got a bag down there. What's in the bag? <clears throat> we got to do better, man. Somebody got to do better. He got a whole Outback Steakhouse. Look, I'm talking about he got like the deep dish pan. Ah, man, butter. I see everything. When I did this on the show Friday, people say, man, it's probably cold. It's probably cold, but it's still Outback Steakhouse in jail. Boys in the hood. Shut up. All right, let's get into something else. Look at this right here. He said, when you 10 days, 20 up, six wows. And hey, damn, that's crazy. And they still won't stop talking. Um, I like this a lot because I be in conversations and I be saying the same thing. I be like, dang, yup, wow. See, mine is word. Damn, that's crazy. I say that a lot. Word? Damn. Word? For real? You bullshit. Come on, man. That's me. I don't want to sit there and talk to you. You're going to hear words like that. Come on, man. You bullshit. For real. Word. Nah. I don't 
don't know. That's how I be sounding. I be talking to people, though. Especially I don't want to hear the conversation. Let's see what this is right here. Kind of broke my heart when I see this. <clears throat> it said, when you finally graduate high school in the United States, and look what they throwing up. Instead of throwing up caps, you know, from the cap and gown, they throwing up bulletproof vests. Ugh, this was kind of nasty work right here when I seen this. I was like, oh, it's so true. And we don't have to be that way. We don't have to live in a society like this. But <clears throat> you can make a meme like this and it just ugh, makes you feel a certain way. I got some truth behind it, man. I ain't really like that one, man, but I had to show it. This right here. This is Will Smith and Chris Rock. They say this is what happened when Will Smith smacked Chris Rock. He left some DNA in them. On them. And this is the picture. Thought that was funny. To me. It made me laugh. What else? Things on Twitter that made me laugh. Well, things I've seen on Twitter. They said, pick the best three villains on this. I'm, I'm going to have to go with Gargamel. I like Gargamel. Gargamel was trying to get them Smurfs. I like see it. So, 8 and 10 for sure. I mean, it's cheating to go with number five. Everybody know beta the shit. Thanos, you know. It's, if you're going with five and 12, you just want to win. You a punk. You don't want to fight. I like, um, what's the name? Not Galvatron. Megatron, he dope. Shredder was dope. At least his costume was. He ain't really kick nobody ass and really do nothing. But I'm going with Gargamel and see it for sure. Um, Magneto, he was tough, especially in the cartoon. I always like Magneto. They say Magneto and Malcolm was Malcolm X and Professor X was Martin Luther King. I did a video about this too, about black comic book characters and I mean not black comic book characters, but how some comic book characters was based off black heroes like Wolverine and Ogun. Y'all gotta do y'all research, man. They stealing everything. All right, here we go. Which one of the best Batmobiles? Which one the best? The Michael West, the Michael oh the no, Adam West, Michael Keaton, Val Kilmer, George Clooney, Christian Bale, Ben Affleck. Me, I'm going with the Michael Keaton. I like Michael Keaton Batman, <coughs> and I like his Batmobile. He was pretty dope. Val Kilmer was alright, but I mean all of them. They, they Batmobile, so you can't go wrong with a Batmobile. If you a Batman enthusiast or... I don't know, man. I like Batman. Batman, he had gadgets and stuff, and he was a real person. Superman, he had power. I ain't like Superman because Superman, he had, like, the skills of Sub-Zero, Cyclops, The Flash. But that's all you seen Superman doing was flying and punching people. You know, I've been loot, lasering everybody with my eyes. I wouldn't have threw one punch if I was Superman. I whew, blew him cold. That's all you seen Superman doing. I don't know, man. So I don't know how I got on Superman from Batman. But um, I like Keaton Batman. I think I can beat up Adam West. That's the only thing. That's the only Batman I think I can beat up. I can beat him up. He had on tights. Everybody else had on like an armor suit. Adam West had on draws and spandex. And he was like 88 years old when he was Batman, so I can beat Adam West. All right. So why alien abductions happen only at night? This right here. He says, 9 p.m. Are you just now telling me you need a human for school tomorrow? That's some parent stuff right there. My kids have definitely told me, oh, we having a party tomorrow. We need such and such cupcakes. I'm like, why? Got to go to Walmart, buy some cupcakes. Middle of the night. This right here was funny, man. They was like, yeah, I'm not going to buy Everett Ross Black Panther. <laughs> I'm not going to buy that toy. But upon further research, my cousin, he told me um, on the show Friday, he was like, yo, that's the one to get. That's going to be the, um, you know, the one that ain't nobody going to have. Ain't nobody going to have uh, Everett Ross. It's going to be a collector's item. So maybe get the Everett Ross, man. I just ain't, I, if I'm going to see Black Panther as a little child, I go to the store. I'm just going to be like, ah, let me get Black Panther. i get him before I get Zuri. I'm not getting no girl toy. That's a doll. Okay. This right here. What? The regular show. I like this picture because this is a shirt, and they took all the shirts, and they folded them just right, just to make them look like this. 
But me, as the hater I am, I said I would go and try to rearrange them if I was in the store. I wouldn't have bought one of them shirts. But I definitely would have rearranged them. If I was going to buy one, I would have still rearranged it. Either way, I would have seen that and hated on it because I'm a hater. I'm sorry, y'all. It's just me, but I like that show, and um, it's pretty cool with that shirt, how they had them all folded like that, because you had to actually do it. You had to unfold some of them levels. I don't know. What else I see on Twitter? <laughs> so you had to pick only these two pills right here. Which one are you going to take? Number one, look younger. Number two, read minds for three days. Three, forget your ex. Four, eat without gaining weight. Five, add centimeters to your height. Six, become super strong. Five, have a lot of money. Eight, always feel happy. And nine. Get a million, get millions of followers. Everybody gonna pick number seven. That's easy. Who don't want a whole bunch of paper? But what else you gonna pick? Um, number three is out the question. I would never remember her ex. Um, number one, look fifteen years young. No, I'm forty years old. And it's hard for me to buy um cigarettes at the store. Sometimes they think I look. They say I look too. I don't know, man. I want to. I'm 40. Why can't I get cigarettes from the store? I'll be hating on me. He have ID? No. It's in the car. We're at home. Hate that. Eat without gaining weight? No. I ain't care about that. I get fat all, all the time. I'm still fat. Um, At five centimeters to your height? No. I'm 40 now. And centimeters ain't that. That ain't, that ain't a, a lot. At a foot. Give me that. Take some years off me and give me some height. I get to the NBA or something. Six become super strong. No. Eight always feel happy. Eh. And nine get a million followers. So seven is um off gate. I think I like to um take number two. I like to read minds for three days. If I can read minds for three days, maybe he can get me a lot of money, even more money, or learn something else. Just learn more tricks to the trade or something. So I'm gonna um seven. Seven and two. That's about it. I think that's the ones I take. Seven and two. <laughs> Look at this. This is a denim burger. Denim, denim, denim. Denim, denim, denim. Um, somebody concocted this. I don't think the burger patty's made out of jeans. I don't know what that is, but the buns, both of the, all the buns made out of that. It's pretty dope when I seen this. Even got the button on there, so. Whoever constructed this, big shout out to you, man. You did your thing. I like it. What else we have? This right here. Ah, this is Sean Claude Van Damme. Sean Claude Van Damme. He was gonna be the one who played inside of the um the Predator. He's gonna be inside a Predator, inside the suit. Um, from what I hear and what I remember, they say he didn't want to do it because it was too hot and all that stuff in there. But mostly because his face wasn't shown. And he wanted to, you know, when he got the movie heard, he wanted his face shown. He wanted to be a big movie star. <clears throat> and they covering his face up. They're like, man, no, nah, I'm Sean Claude Van Damme. I don't need to be in here in the suit. I need my face shown. So, that's that's pictures of him inside of the suit, though. He wound up quitting. Big shout out to him. Bloodsport, Kickboxer, all that. He had some dope movies back then. Now, this is the International Hand Symbol for What the hell are you going for? What the hell is going on with this guy? Something like that. What the hell is this guy doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the word. And that's true. This nigga. That's how I do. This This motherfucker. It's true. <laughs> Said Jesus hears you. He just wants you to fucking beg for it. <laughs> this right here will get you in trouble right here. <coughs> for the Christians. They don't like saying stuff like this, but. I thought it was funny, man. In this little suit. Jesus. This dude right here. He got a shirt pulled up like that. But it's like he has on the thong. A big thong, too. It's like a... Ugh. But it's nothing but a chair. So he is not at the bar looking like that. Big shout out to him, though. This right here. He said, my hobbies include switching between the same three apps for hours, not speaking to anyone for days, listening to the same songs I've been listening to for 15 years, and imagining myself in situations that would literally never exist. It's pretty dope. It's like me, too. I switch to the same three apps I keep going on. YouTube, Facebook. I mean, not, not Facebook, but YouTube, Twitter, and TikTok. 
Sometimes I, I man, I barely go on TikTok. I don't like TikTok because I don't like the changing of musics. You watching one thing, then you scroll up and da -da 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 -da. you hear Latino music. Next thing you know, whoo, hear some Chinese music. Next thing you know, you hear explosions and stuff. Every time you turn, I can't do that, man. This, I'm weird. I don't like TikTok. Alright, here we go. Look at this. So you can pick only three of these people to be in the movie. Who you gonna pick? I'm definitely going with number five. I say I take three, and I take seven. Three, five, seven. Get loose. Three, five, seven. Get. You gotta be old to know that reference. But um, yeah, I take Calvin Candy. What's the name? Denzel. He all right. I could do a Denzel movie, but mm -hmm. I'm definitely taking Robert De Niro, Jamie Fox. And Leonardo DiCaprio. I could do a rock movie, but he just did that damn Black Adam. Blech! Trash. Robin Williams, he gone. Mm -hmm. Matt Damon. Ryan Gosling. Will Smith. Nah, he might slap me. Christian Bell. Yeah, all right. Oh, Tom Hanks. I might do a Tom Hanks movie too, though. Tom Hanks done. They might try to make me bubble, though. I ain't trying to be that. I got big gum, sir. Nah. Look at this. He said, I bet aliens ride past the earth and lock their doors. <laughs> we are the ghetto of the of the atmosphere. We call it the um the outer space. We the ghetto of the galaxy. I know they lock their doors like ugh. Earthlings. Look at them. Ugh. 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 <clears throat> Alright, what else? I like this one right here. He said decisions made in anger will ruin your life. And that is true. He out there reaching for a bird. He trying to Arr! and imagine, even if he got the bird, he still ass out. Mm, mm, mm. And that's like that's pretty dope, man. I like that concept. What else? This right here. Pick your favorite three robots. I'm going with Bender off gate. I like Robocop. Mm, I probably had to go with that that bird number eleven. I ain't no Iron Giant fan. I don't know. I don't know nine, six, three, or ten, or twelve. I know Johnny Five. He all right. I don't know number five. I only, I only know a few of them. So <clears throat> I'm definitely picking RoboCop. <laughs> Which one of these places would you eat at? Krusty Krab, Bob's Burger, Krusty Burger, or uh, um? Lardo, Big Lad, Donut. I don't know this one. I mean, I know what this is. It's from um, The Simpsons, but I don't know the name of it. And it had to be... <clears throat> I had to take that donut place. First of all, I'm not eating nowhere called Krusty nothing. Krusty Crab or the Krusty Burger. I don't want none of them. Boom. And I don't trust Bob Burgers. When we was doing the show Friday, uh, my wife referenced that um, Bob Burgers is supposed to have been a cannibal place. They had a mortuary beside it. When they first came up with the show idea, that's what it was going to be. It was going to be cannibals. But that ain't the reason why. I say I don't want to do it because they house right on top of their restaurant. I mean, they could be slacking a little bit because, you know, they live there. They might not be washing stuff all the way in. I don't know, man. I just don't trust people that like that. I don't know, man. Maybe I'm using a... I'm saying it wrong or something, but <clears throat> they live too close to it. And, you know, people like to neglect shit sometimes when it's their shit. And, mm -hmm. ain't got, I don't know, it's just me. Ooh, these some more villains right here. Who the biggest hater of these villains right here? Who the biggest hater? I say is number five, Randall. Number one, Stinky Pete. And probably... Shit, that's about it. I think them like the two biggest haters. No, one in five. I mean, Mr. Burns, he was a hater. Oh, girl, she's trying to get the um, Dalmatians for the coat. Oh, maybe Ursula. She ain't like that girl because she sang the Little Mermaid. So, y'all pick y'all own. But <clears throat> this right here made me laugh too. This is Dorito bag, tortillo, Tostitos bag, or something. Look like. He got some eyes or something. I don't know. It just made me smile when I seen this. I be seeing stuff sometimes. Make me laugh on Twitter. And that's it. 
Gonna be doing this again next week because I got some more stuff that made me smile already. That will be showing on the show Friday at 9 p.m. If y'all want to get an extra look at it or look first, because I'm going to be doing this. This is what things I've seen on Twitter, part six. So the things I'm going to show Friday is, will be part seven. I don't know. We have fun over here, though. I'll be doing this every Friday at 9 p.m. Come through and I'll let your boy hit that like button, the comment button, the share button, the subscribe button, the notification bell, all them good buttons you got to hit to get this pimping when I'm if I put out when I put it out. Something like that. Anyway, I'll let your boy. Heist man the foe. All right, this time, but I'll be back, and sooner than you think. Wherever there's prejudice, ignorance, inequality, I'll be there.